Good afternoon and greetings from Bish's RV of the Quad Cities. Once again, this is Pete and we've got a bushwhacker for you today, but it's a brand new floor plan, Braxton Creek's Bushwhacker. It's a 2023 Model 12 SK. And this presentation is brought to you by Bish's RV of the Quad Cities. All right, we're gonna start with the front view here of the swept air dynamic front there with the diamond plate rock chip guard included crank down stabilizer jack 20 pound lp tank on there we do outfit you with a battery on a box if you wish it would go right there we've got all your connections right up here on the front otherwise that is a very handy rack for cargo storage on there dual entryways on this unit on both the uh, campsite and the off side all right working our way around through here we've got your solar quick connect right down through here this is the offside door with the scare light on there. And you have a cargo rack up on the top there. You can see the tanks for that cargo rack. And I bet you're going to wonder what would be the overall height on the unit. Well, the overall height with the cargo rack on there, six foot, 10 inches. So that'll fit in under your seven foot garage door. Okay, coming along over to here. Wow, look at this, you have some aggressive High rise tires on here on the Dexter support axle. That's a torsion flex axle, 2200 pound axle on the unit. Look at that ground clearance. Awesome. Low point drains right under there. Check this out. You've got a water heater now. The previous units, the smaller ones, don't have a water heater. Now you've got a water heater on here. Fresh water connection there that gives you, leads you directly to your gravity filler, leads you directly to a 24 gallon tank on board. City water connection provided as well 30 amp twist lock electrical cord that's a 30 foot detachable cord on their exterior camp shower hey that's something new too we haven't had that on the smaller bushwhacker units exterior shower all right crank down sand pads equipped stabilizer jacks on the back one to each side obviously all right now check this out this is way cool here is where we talk we're talking about breakfast central here here's where you get your cooking action done got the griddle right on here as well as a sink and that connects by the griddle connects to the uh, LP gas by way of the quick connect underneath there and the sink connects by way of the quick connect over to your spray port right down over here right ab uh, below the GFCI protected electrical outlet how cool is that the whole apparatus obviously slides straight on in for easy stowage and you have the swing down legs there for extra stability Okay, coming around over to here, we have an exterior speaker here to provide sound from the outside. We'll take another look at the roof there where you can tell we've got the roof racks on there. And on over to here, I bet you're wondering what's in behind here. All right, guess no more. Here we go. Wah, refrigerator. And I bet your next question is, well, okay, that's nice, but what kind of refrigerator? It's a 12 volt refrigerator. That is impressive. So, Yes, you can go boondocking and operate your refrigerator accordingly. Now you're gonna to wanna to use a larger group battery if you're gonna do that to sustain, uh, have sustainability on your uh, battery and or have a solar panel. Like I say, you can easily add one on there because you have that solar port on the front. Okay, let's take a peek on the inside. One of the two doors. And notice you're going to have both a latch lock as well as a deadbolt security lock on these, a safety feature. Another thing to bear in mind, once you get the door open, you can operate and use that window and still have your deadbolt shut. Bear that in mind in terms of a safety or security feature. You'll have that breeze coming through with, with your door secured shut. Okay, we've got a diamond plate step up on in with a assist handle here. Again, another light overhead, LSD light on there. Now check this out. This is something different that you don't have on the smaller unit either. And that's some counter space right up and over the top there. Another electrical outlet, charge ports for your USB devices, huge storage in over there. We'll, we'll discover that from the other side. We'll step around to the other side and take a look at that. Now, the vortex fan. This is a big and important feature here. You crank up your uh, rooftop and that is a three speed fan. Way cool, way awesome. Here we've got 5,000 BTUs of air conditioning provided on the side mounted air conditioning unit. Now, over here would be your converter unit. 
and that ha does feature the auto detect so you can add a lithium battery or use lead acid battery or whatever it'll automatically adjust so that you'll get the proper charge rate based on your battery type up above that you've got your controls for the water heater all right here's your ducting this is a 12,000 BTU furnace that's also a part of the whole work safety detectors are included in there and over here would be your area with the TV backer with the uh, coax connection right up above where you would add an optional TV set at your discretion. 12 volt TVs are a common feature or uh, an option for this particular situation if you're planning to do any boondocking. All right, let's take a quick look in from the other side. Coming around over to here, the same features apply on this door with the uh, deadbolt security latch that we discussed earlier. Okay, entertainment center. The IRV Entertainment Center plus the speakers as I zoom it out a little bit you can see the speakers to the side and we'll take a look going over this away. Here's your thermostat that operates both the furnace uh, or operates just the furnace I should say. The other thermostat for the air conditioner would be on the air conditioner. There we go and you've got your 12 volt fuses as well as your 110 volt fuses in there to boot pretty cool. I think we've pretty well covered just about everything inside this 2023 Braxton Creek Bushwhacker model number 12SK. With a final reminder, this presentation comes to compliments of Bish's RV of the Quad Cities. Thank you.